For the single ladies and single men in the room, if you're wondering what site they met on, delete your Bumble, delete your Tinder, delete your Christian connection, and get on LinkedIn. That's right, everybody. I remember the first time I met you. You seemed like a gentle and sweet man who also had incredibly nice skin. You know, she's charming, she's witty, she knows what she wants and she goes and gets it. And then I saw her with James and I went, ah, oh, opposites really do attract. It's hard to kind of know what to say to you in front of everyone right now. So here it goes. I've got three catchphrases that Mary often says. Firstly, <clears throat> what's up, player? <laughs> I believe this is either a greeting from Southwest Sydney or it's just how Mary greets me. <laughs> this is just a fun one because this is, there is a really cheeky and playful side to Mary that I love. Love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud. It is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. I hope she wasn't too much trouble for you, James. <laughs> I encourage you to love each other as God love us. Audience of one. It means that whatever we do, we do it for God. Mary has shared this countless times and has helped encourage me uh, to have more confidence in what I do or say because it only matters to God. And it gives me great confidence knowing that if I fail someone else, it's okay. I'm so thankful to God that this day has finally come. I can't wait to start this new chapter together and serve God. May we be lights that make Jesus shine. <laughs> Your mercy flows like a river wide and healing. And lastly, comes from your come, Lord Jesus, come, is what Mary likes to say. Well, it's self explanatory, but whenever there's some hardship we've faced or seen together, or we're feeling down, or we've sinned against God, this is a helpful plea that we hope for the day that Jesus returns. We know that He will, and that gives us the hope to endure through the tough times. There is none like you. No one else Mary, today we made some important promises to each other. I look forward to welcoming you into my Frisbee team. And one day, God willing, we can raise kids of our own that would grow to love Jesus as well. My prayer is that we would keep seeking to model our marriage after Christ's love for the church as we've heard this morning, and for me to lay down my life for you continuously and graciously. I love you, and I'm so proud to call you my wife. Thank you.